Hello YouTube, uh, this is how to give money to your teammates on transit, zombies, um, I promised to make a video on zombies so here I'm playing with two best, two of my good friends that are really good at zombies, um, I recommend playing with them but yeah so this time we're gonna show you guys how to give money to your own teammate. Just waiting for the match to load. So, if you don't know where the pieces are to make the turbine, you will find one near the door to using the power. So, there's a fan. Go over to the table, press X, or hold it, I mean. Once that, you go to the telephone, and, and there's a little piece right there you get. Yes, and one of my friends picked up the one of the, the mannequins, which is already built. Pick one up. The hell's this doohickey do? And it's a really good way to not pay for the door, and just, like, get out without wasting any money. Device for, uh... Yeah. So right now I'm teabagging because my friends thought I was recording but I was I was just messing around with them. So here we are, you place it right here to get out. Place it the same place right there. Or if you get lucky you can you can actually open the both doors without having to put it again. Here I will show you guys this is where a rock would be placed. And my, the way the thing that my friend is doing to the bus driver is getting him pissed off. So supposedly, so he could skip the map, but he won't, and he gets really pissed off, and it's pretty quite funny. Um, if you piss him off too much, there's a point where he opens the door and he like pushes everyone to the right side, and if he get pushed to the right side and knocked out out of the window, right here, watch. Oh, almost knocked us out, but we can't open the door. You'll see when we can open the door. No zombies. So yeah, he starts cussing and starts like saying bad words and all that, which is pretty funny. And here, I try to open the door, but it's not letting me open it because the bus driver's like, "Oh, your your right to leave the bus is not permit. It's um, what do you call it? She's taken away." <laughs> so yeah, just. Got round one done. So now we can open it since our privilege is back. So the question is how to give money to your teammates? Well, it's pretty much if you don't get the piece that goes on top to go to the to the bus, well that makes um you yeah you could just put it in the diner and the diner uh, there's gambling knuckles in, in the uh, on top of the diner and when you put when you place it up there uh, you can get the gambling knuckles and use it for town and in town there's this you know the banking system and there's this other place which I don't really think that no one knows um, where you could actually give money to your teammates when either you fill up your bank which I have done and my friend done so we were just giving our money to one of my friends yeah memo so yeah here you would find that little piece to the floor which I couldn't find so it would either be to your next to that cabinet or on the floor Meat lockers with this. These things go monkeys are really great to have. Um, not having monkeys on this game, which will really screw up everyone because um, where we like to be at is in the pack punch. And being in the pack punch, you can have two people covering one side and two people on the other side. And that's a great strategy to have. Um, you'll make it to high rounds. 
and also it's great to have someone outside just in case everything gets crowded one person can stay alive and if that person stays alive then well you'll you'll be able to play another round so here I'm just knifing this robot bus driver getting him mad which is pretty funny to get him mad and get cussed at farm so we don't have to stop there and there's a point where I pissed them off and I think my friend gets knocked out or kicked out yep he gets locked out so now we can't he can't open door so we're just stuck in here I have to shoot off these zombies wait for my friend yeah memo to get back in hey, get back. Or I'll kill you again pretty awesome just getting the bus driver mad and just happen to have the doors locked see he can't open it so there we go just rebuilding barriers getting more money so the way I'm rank um, I don't know what rank I am but I think I'm on I have a skull and then I have a, like a knife behind my skull with the five hash marks, five dash marks, whatever. Um, I'm pretty. Well, I, I would say I'm good at zombies, but I just want to get into the higher, higher ranking. But I have to get more better with my strategies and stuff. Perhaps it is socialist Stuhlinger, but someone needs to share ammo. With um. I don't know if you guys noticed, but there's like green orbs that come out, and those orbs, um, no bullets. I don't know if they mean that you level up or something, but I just think that you can, um, it's either leveling up or just being faster at doing something like either reloading, uh, repairing barriers, or reviving your friend quickly, so, yeah, so here, if you don't know how to turn this on the power, there's a piece right there. That See that piece that he dropped? That that's where that's the thing that you need for the goblin knuckles. Um, there's a piece to your right, which could be the arm. So you pick up the arm. As for the handle, and there's a piece right there to your right for the back piece. So now we're turning on the power. Well, I'm gonna have to either put place my oh, I got locked down. See, he opens it with the turbine. That way, you don't have to wait for the power to be fully turned on. They're gonna have his. Oh, he fell. Huh? <laughs> Sucks for him. Well, they're gonna have right now is is great. It's good. I pack a punch it. It's, yeah, it's a good gun. You can you can have it full auto three or whatever burst fire it is originally. So I'm just waiting for my friend to get back on. So now we're going to town and gonna hopefully. Um, see if the, the if the power is on not the power um, if the door to the vault where you could go pack punch it if it's open so the, that green light right there you see if you get one of those little whatever those Why did I fire off well, all well me and my friends call it Frodo's or Lady Gaga's because it look like a Lady Gaga um, if you place one if you have one in your head and you run towards towards that light it actually makes you a teleporter which is pretty nice if you're trying to go like place to place or instead of walking or anything so yeah here you open the vault by throwing a grenade throwing another grenade over there to your right side yep it's open so now we go down there look for the I'm I will I look for the pieces for pack punch Find the top piece over here. 
there's other places where it could spawn like sometimes it could like mix match and all that um, the power box is usually right here to your next to the table with a, yes that is it I am an indisputable genius and for the last piece it usually is at either in, in the opening or to this window so as I said this gun is pretty good um, get a round burst in the in the head real quick so I'm just basically I'm the person who usually stays down here just to not have the box closed or anything I mean not the box Fishing, pack punch room fusion, door you're dead either way. so I put in the blast piece and it's ready to go so here we're just gonna be racking up points until I I can get enough points to go get the gavelin knuckles and from there go to go and show you guys how to get money to your friends so first it was only us three to join but then this other guy I don't know who he is but he joined the he joined our match just to like troll but didn't work um so yeah see to your right see in the right hand side in the bottom where it shows like some some sort of like magazines but it actually isn't a magazine it's a nap card and that can be used to either I don't know I haven't done the easter egg yet but I'm thinking it's for the easter egg uh, so yeah we were at the point of doing the easter egg and here as you can see I can't I can uh, deposit money. I have like I don't know how what the max max uh out of ammunition. What the max is for um that means I will for depositing your money. Um, I deposited at least well twenty thousand each game I played. So um, sometimes I, I like withdraw like ten thousand each game, so it evens out. So you need basically you need in this the match so you need intense. juggernaut. Juggernog, um, stamina up or and what do you call it? Speed cola. Speed cola is a it's really needed in this match. Not having speed cola, you, well, I don't know how you would survive then. Um, so yeah, we're just waiting for our friend to go over there, go over and attach that little piece to the to the top. Oh, never mind. So here I'm a pack How punch this gun. Ammunition, Marlton? Hopefully. I was getting synchrotons, but so what? I needed ammo. So here I have it. So now I'm going to show you guys how to do the piece. So here we have the last zombie and um, here I'm going to show you guys how to uh, how to give the money to the to your teammate and by that you have to well not here but you go to this little chest down there you with the gavel knuckles you punch it and when you punch it you can hold you um it tells you to hold X and by holding holding or pressing X you give money as you can see to your right and you can go and grab it. Um this time I could punch it and just by me punching it I could um give the money to him. Or he could give the money back to me if whatever works. So yeah, uh, here I'm gonna show you just by me hitting that he could give me back my money. So there he goes, deposit the money, then my numbers would change. So yeah, uh, that's how that's how you give money to your teammate. Uh, made might have been a long or whatnot video, but yeah. So just like, subscribe. Um, 
comment, and yeah, see you guys soon.